no hostages, but we know that uh, we have information that there are, there can be hostages, and we do not even know whether or not they are alive or not. Therefore, the international community should be more uh, strict on such issues. So, if I understand right, you are saying that the Russian peacekeepers there do not have the mandate to uh, exercise force to open the road. Uh, they do not have authorization for. Uh, they do not have authorization for exercising force. Because if it's not pre-agreed, if there is no international mandate, if they, it is not bilaterally agreed, then it will be hard for them to achieve that goal. If something happens, it can cause greater issues. That is why it is being regulated at the highest level, at the level of heads of states, including these uh, small issues. China is for poker caro gelin el meko rishi amar me samar sa kyan kiev mahvan harce. Although it can seem small for someone else, for us it's a matter of life and death. When this case, when this incident happens, happened from the Armenian side, there was information that this happened in a mutually agreed way. And when they entered Ivanian community, do you have any information how it happened and what kind of mutually agreed uh, way they are speaking about? Do you think for Arachiat? You know that first, the first such incident was also a terror act by the Azerbaijanis. Yeah, the first such incident was also a terror act by the Azerbaijanis. Yeah, the first such incident was also a terror act by the Azerbaijanis. Yeah, the first such incident was also a terror act by the and to settle the matter, it was agreed that they can come on the spot, see that there is no issues, but this could have been done without terrorism. And because they were and if there are questions, we also have questions, they can be discussed in civilized ways. We never rejected dialogue, negotiations, there are current issues that can be uh, discussed, but this doesn't mean that we are subjects of Azerbaijan, we should speak as subjects of Azerbaijan. No, we should speak as equal subjects. Yes. Equal actors, equal entities. Mm -hmm. Mr. Babaya, don't you think by blockading Artsakh, Azerbaijan might be trying to get cons consensus from from compromises, compromises from Armenia? But I no man zero. Pastor, I'm just going to say that I'm going to go to the 
it can't be excluded, but such a way is a gross violation of international law. Nahe varaj, hay adar bejana kan hara berutsuneri kar kavuruma. Chinayat in chur kap kapvats e poh kapaktvats adar bejana kara bain hakamar chan kar komis. But hayla in cheli dasra kirku har al har tutsunum engatnu. First of all, Armenia-Azerbaijan relations or regulation of these relations is not mere uh, with the Azerbaijan with uh, Artsakh issue. This is completely different platforms. Hete vabar ISPC chun shumnerov korzel inchor albaner da inknin mijazgai nira unki khaktam. Therefore, to get something by such pressures is already violation of the international law. Yev yerkor to ISPC gortu gortuneri mijazgai martasiyakan. Իրավունքի գարշելի խախտումները։ Secondly, such actions are horrible violations of the international humanitarian law. Mr. Sepanyan, you said that Artsakh does not have air communication with uh, uh, Armenia, but we have an airport in Artsakh, and uh, if necessary, would it be possible with the help of the Russian peacekeepers to ensure air communication? Yes, Hartsin is the same thing. It's not a naive, but it's an Arabic line. I'll part of it, but Kelini. I will say not only it should be possible, but it should be mandatory. Որով հետև ամենավաց ծենալում տեսնում ենք, որ այսինքն ամբողջական բլոկադան արցախի ժողորդի նշանակելու է, որ արդեն այսք նշել ենք, թե ինչ հետևանքների է հանգեցնելու։ Եվ եթե հնարավոր չէ ծամակային կապը ապահո� պարտադիր է, 